Hi, I'm Joseph Romagnolo. I'm a professor of medicine uh, in the Digestive Disease Center at the Medical University of South Carolina. And I'm a therapeutic endoscopist and the director of clinical research here. There are patients who have a bowel duct obstruction where the liver isn't able to drain into the intestine, and that can be for cancer reasons or non-cancer reasons. The traditional procedure to drain those ducts to get rid of jaundice is called an ERCP, and that's a procedure done with an endoscope. In about 5 to 10% of ERCPs, we fail to get into the bile duct, and the alternative would be to place a drain through the skin, underneath the ribs, uh, into the liver to drain the bile externally. But that's an uncomfortable procedure to have, and you have to walk around with a drainage bag uh, for several weeks and, and uh, perhaps even longer. We're working on an alternative to that PTC procedure and the EOS guided biliary drainage is that alternative. We go down with a, an ultrasound uh, guided scope that visualizes the obstructed bile duct from inside the intestine and then makes a hole into the bile duct from the intestine and either places a drainage tube directly into the duct or puts a wire down uh, the regular route and allows us to do the procedure the regular way without having to have any external drains. Paula Deloach and I'm from Orangeburg, South Carolina. I have pancreatic cancer. Well, I think it was better for me to not have the bag. I didn't want the bag. Currently, this procedure requires an endoscopist and a center that is experienced in both advanced EUS and advanced ERCP procedures. It's limited to only certain centers, and only a handful of centers in the United States are performing this. We're the only center, and I'm the only endoscopist in South Carolina performing uh, the EUS guided biliary drainage procedure at this point. 